problem in traditional uh, chemotherapy uh, for the treatment of cancer is that uh, the drugs are not selective and that they are uh, harming uh, other parts of the body resulting in side effects. More than 100 years ago, the Nobel laureate and physician Paul Ehrlich had the idea of creating a magic bullet, uh, eine Zauberkugel, which would then target directly uh, the tumor or the cause of the, of the disease. We embarked a couple of years ago on this joint project and it was possible to uh, collect a number of scientists all over Europe to contribute their knowledge to uh, the magic bullet idea and uh, we were receiving funding from uh, the European Union in the frame of the Horizon 2020 program to develop this idea and also to train young scientists in this challenging research area. The problem with traditional chemotherapy for the treatment of cancer is uh, that the cytotoxic drug which is applied can harm both the healthy cell and the cancer cell. But cancer displays different characteristics and one of them are specific proteins which are overexpressed on the cancer cell surface and are not present on the healthy tissues. In the frame of the Magic Bullet project we focus on synthetic peptides which can recognize these cell surface proteins. We connect these peptides to the cytotoxic drugs and now the complex can recognize only the cancer cell and kill it selectively. In order to create these magic bullets, what we do is we meet with scientists with other backgrounds and all in together we design a molecule that can be uh, of interest and can meet our criteria for having nice uh, properties and anti-cancer properties. And once we have decided what we want to synthesize, then we start the synthesis and we just do the reactions. We do different techniques and using different conditions. And after each reaction, we purify our compounds. We check that we obtained the compound of interest. And after several steps, then we get into the product that we desired. And then this product can be tested. There is a close collaboration between uh, biologists and chemists and uh, the biologists are testing the compounds uh, that are prepared uh, from the chemists and uh, uh, what we want to reach uh, is the selectivity towards the tumor cell lines. So for this reason uh, we use uh, different cell lines, tumor cell lines and healthy cell lines and we compare how the toxicity changes uh, in the different uh, cells. So we do some uh, uh, cytotoxicity assays and also we can uh, look uh, how much uh, the compounds are going uh, inside the cells uh, and uh, um, look uh, if there is uh, a real uh, selectivity. It was really a great experience to work in, in the Magic Bullet because the partners interacted very well with each other. It is not an easy task to develop new drug conjugates for directed therapy and I really would like to stress that it is basic research so the perspective of bringing things into the clinic is a long-term perspective, so we cannot expect these ideas to be converted into reality in a, in, in a short frame of time. But we have uh, promising uh, results, promising uh, data, preclinical data, of course, so we are really keen to continue the collaboration with our partners uh, in order to establish uh, these networks and these, uh, these close collaborations.